Hi, we're here with Jose Garces, the founder of the Garces Restaurant Group. Jose, your career has been a rocket to the top. What is the most surprising to you about where you are now in your life's journey? Uh, I think the most surprising thing is that uh, just the amount of success we've had uh, with each of the concepts we've done. Uh, they're all kind of, um, you know, visions or ideas that uh, have formulated through my head and to be able to actually uh, produce them and, and see them flourish has been, has been fantastic. And you've had quite a run on television. Were you ever nervous before putting your foot in that pond? Yeah, I think it's it's always risky to uh, you know put your put yourself out there in front of the cameras and especially in front of a national televised uh, audience. But you know if you don't try, you know nothing will happen. So <laughs> I wanted to give it a shot. And how do you operate? You operate between Philadelphia, Chicago. How do you manage your time? Uh, currently, right now, we have seven stores in Philadelphia. So. I'm based there and, and all of the restaurants are within a, like a two mile radius so they're really easy to get to. Um, I come out to Chicago probably once a month to check in on the store here. And you work for Steven Starr, a big restaurateur in Philly. Yeah. How, how do you know, how did you make the decision it's time to move along? I think that as a chef you, you start to realize at a certain point that you know you could do this yourself and you could you know obviously um, invest your own time and your own money into uh, creating something successful for yourself as opposed to for somebody else. And are you finding any difference with the, with the, the new entrance into the industry coming out of the culinary schools today than when you started? Yeah, I think that there's you know, a bit of a misconception. I think television has a lot to do with that. You know, people think um, they're going to graduate from culinary school and be, uh, be celebrity chefs right off the bat. I think. Uh, but the industry has a way of kind of putting people <laughs> kind of in their place. You know, you have to like pay your dues here. You have to, uh, I, I certainly did. I worked for about 10 or 15 years before I opened my own place. So it's, um, it's, uh, it's a tough road, no doubt. And what would you say on average is, is a work week in terms of hours for you now at this stage of your career? Uh, right now I would say it's anywhere from uh, 60 to 60 to 70 but it doesn't it doesn't really stop you know even I, I, I couldn't even really put a true number on it I mean if I'm home I'm still working I'm still thinking about it so it's hard to put it away. Right?